Hi everyone, my name is Abby Smith. I am the Savory Global Network Coordinator. And last week I was in Zimbabwe for the Hub Leadership Bootcamp, which is the training that all new Hub leaders need to go through. And while we were there, there was a conversation that I thought was really interesting and worth sharing with everyone between Alan Savory and Jacob, who is one of the Hub leaders from Uganda. And he was talking to Alan Savory about herding techniques and why uh, herd effect matters. In holistic management, herd effect is one of the tools we have to influence our ecosystem. And what Alan was saying is in traditional pastoralist uh, practices, what happens is the herd will bunch together and trample and dung and urinate while they're moving. And so they get that high density um, herd effect. But when they stop to graze, the herder will sit back and the cattle will spread out. So they're not having that same herd effect that they do when they're moving. And so you don't get the impact that we need on the land. And Alan also said that fencing does not create herd effect. And that really hit home for me because in the United States, we don't typically use herding. We use fencing to control stock density. And so what Spencer and I talked about doing is this summer doing a little experiment to actually herd for half an hour, 45 minutes every day within the fences that we have as part of our grazing plan so that we can get that herd effect and we'll see what happens on the land and really look forward to sharing the outcomes of that with, with everyone as we go forward. So from all of us, we say bye-bye.